Hello there, Pisces. How are you doing? It is your girl, Jalissa. Please like, share, comment, subscribe, follow me wherever you found me. Bless. I have a New Year's reading for you. All right, so let's get it. Let's go. Loud ass car back there. All right, so something could be really loud or somebody has a loud car. Anyway, your general first message that came out here is we're going to talk about a younger man, all right? So this could be a relative. This could be a friend. This could be a lover. This could be whoever, right? It's a younger man, though. I'm getting you're dealing with a younger man, and I'm getting somebody snitching. So either this younger man is snitching or somebody snitching about you dealing with this younger man. Take it how it resonates, please. All right? I'm getting that you're going to have a friend that's going to give you some valid criticism. Listen to this friend because I'm getting this friend has your best interest at heart. And whatever this criticism is that the friend is giving you is to bring you something positive. All right. Get you out of some sort of um situation where someone's actually working against you. Because I'm seeing whoever this younger man, either this is the person that's giving you valid criticism or this is the person that's doing it. Put it where it fits. But I'm getting someone is working behind your back. They're working against you. And so you're going to get this valid criticism letting you know what to do with this situation. Like, yo, I don't really trust that person. Or I don't really trust you dealing with that person because I feel like this person is a rat. All right? Because that's what we got here, a rat. This person's a snitch. This person's talking your business. And whatever they're saying is true. It's true. I, I see it right here, all right? I see you have an admirer, all right? You have someone new coming into your life in May, okay? Springtime, you may be dealing with a Capricorn because you got a lot of similar messages from Capricorn's reading, all right? So you could either have Capricorn in your chart. You may want to go check out that reading as well, or you're dealing with a Capricorn, and this is why it's kind of mirroring, okay? But take it how it resonates. doesn't even have to, but I'm seeing it. There's, there's something very similar here to Capricorn's reading. Someone... And their reading is being a snitch and acting stupid. And someone in your reading is doing the same thing. All right. Or maybe y'all just twinning right now. All right. But I'm seeing that you will be taken care of during difficult times. I'm getting you're going to go on a short journey. Listen to that criticism. This criticism could be about a trip with a younger man or a younger man telling you about a trip. All right. Because I'm getting it's going to save you or protect you. All right. You have an admirer, somebody watching you from like behind the scenes. They watch him, but they're not saying nothing. Somebody's very interested in you. I'm getting that sooner than later you will get recognition okay pisces um i do feel like you feel as if you've put in a lot of work or you put in a lot of effort into something this could be your business this could be your career or this could be a situation you have put in so much you've been patient you're waiting for your crops to grow and it's like yo where, where is it growing when is it coming i'm getting that you planted your seeds in the wrong dirt okay there is a such thing of soil not being healthy, soil being contaminated. So we need to be careful where we plant our seeds. So I'm seeing that you planted your seeds in the past in this soil, but the soil is contaminated. So it's not birthing anything profitable for you. And so you're getting a little frustrated and I'm getting bad news coming in. And so that's where the criticism comes into play, where someone's letting you know, like, listen, it's not you. It's dumb. It's not you, it's the situation. You know what I'm saying? So it could be a work situation or a love situation or a family situation. Put it where it fits. But I'm seeing that something isn't birthing or something isn't flourishing or profiting you at this time. And you may be frustrated financially about it or maybe frustrated with time or something. But the reason is because something isn't in your favor. Someone's working against you. You have somebody here snitching. I'm getting you manifesting, though, on the low. Like, you're keeping things quiet. You're manifesting. Be very careful dealing with an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. And like I did say, it did match your reading. Because I'm getting here that there is someone here that is a gold digger. Someone here that is... um. They don't even have to be a nerve sign, all right? But just take it how it resonates. I'm seeing someone here that's greedy. They're stupid. They like to take people's money. They like to use people for money or whatever. This person takes advantage of people and puts people in positions where they could benefit from it. But then at the end of the day, if something goes wrong, you pay for it, not them. All right? So that makes sense. This is a manipulator. This person man manipulates people with money. So you may have invested in something with this person and you're finding out that's the bad news. You're not going to get your profit or your money back or something of this nature. Or this person used you for your money or your resources and i'm getting you manifesting secretly a way out of this and i see you taking a new path and i see your roads opening up all right so sometimes it's the people around us that slow us down and it's not even us all right sometimes god will not open up those doors or give you those blessings because you have the wrong people around you that will ruin your blessings or ruin an opportunity for you so i'm getting you taking a new path in the near future you're taking some sort of initiative to move forward and, and go take a different path where you're not around this snitch or this stupid person over here that is you using you and 
I don't know, they're using you in one way or another, whether they're using your resources, your money, or your time, they're using you. And I'm getting it's involving a younger man or it's a younger man. Take it how it resonates. And so the universe is guiding you in a different direction, and I do see you taking it. Mm -hmm. Your hard work is about to pay off, Pisces. All right, so if you've been waiting, like, I see you waiting, like, frustrated, like, man, when is something coming in? It's about to. It's about to. You're about to get your basket full of fruits. It's just that the universe wants to make sure some people are not around you when it comes because then you won't be able to enjoy your harvest, if that makes sense. We have human resources here, so this is where you will, like, shine, Pisces. You shine when it comes to people, okay? You will shine as a career coach, a life coach, all right, a motivational speaker. You will shine as a person that helps others, that motivates others, kind of like a hype person, you know? That, that's like your field right there is what I'm seeing. You do very well with that. You also do very well when it comes to constructions or trades, all right? So you would do very well as an architect, a designer, a plumber, a welder, electrician, construction manager. Like you would do really well in this field as well. All right, so consider going into business with your family. All right, maybe that's what you're manifesting. You're manifesting a business with your family or something like that. You may want to consider this. A financial offer will be accepted. All right, good news. All right, so there's some sort of financial offer that's going to be expect accepted. Okay, you're expected for it to be ex accepted. It will be accepted. Things will go in your favor is what I'm seeing. This is a great opportunity to you, for you to make extra money. All right, so I feel like you're going to start some sort of side hustle with family or something like that. You're going to go into business with family or you're deciding to. I feel like it will work out in your favor, okay? We have drinks here, so I'm getting that you're drunk in love with someone or you or you may have drunk sex with someone because you're drunk, okay? <laughs> it's going to come off as a wish fulfillment with the star here. All right, you're going to feel like, oh, what a bright future. All right, so you're about to have some bomb-ass drunk sex is what I'm getting. Um, you're coming out of the darkness is what I'm getting. A wish fulfillment is coming your way. You have some sort of reunion here, all right? So you're having a reconciliation with someone else, possibly over drinks, okay? I'm getting that. You're resolving some sort of conflict with someone, all right? But I'm getting that you have two lovers, all right? Because I'm getting someone, um, you have an admirer, and then you have, like, a current lover or someone around you at this time. So you're going to have to choose, Pisces. You can't have both. Don't do the cheating because it will catch up with you, all right? Karma, karma knows everything, and karma definitely spins the block, all right? So don't be playing with people's hearts out here, Pisces, because I see a love triangle here. You loving two people, all right? But you have to make a decision because I'm seeing that there's a next chapter in your love life coming up, and it only involves one person. If you do consider keeping both, you're going to have headaches, okay? <laughs> All right, I love you, Pisces. Mwah. Happy New Year's, and I wish you nothing but the best. I'll see you in the next one. Deuces.